Chief of the Air Staff, Air Marshal Isia Kamau, accompanied by other senior officers on Sunday, arrived at the Nigeria Air Force Base in Kaduna on his first operational visit to the state since his appointment as Nigeria's 21st Chief of Air Staff. During the two-day working visit, Air Marshal Amau will visit units and commands to appraise operations. Air Marshal Amau says banditry and other security challenges confronting the nation will surely be defeated. He promised that there will be synergy among the service chiefs going forward. They are ready for the battle against the bandits and the kidnappers. We have also come here today to see their operational readiness and in line with the directives of the president and commander in chief that said that we must ensure that uh, uh, people are allowed to go to their farm once the rainy season starts and we are working towards that with the other security agencies with the the platforms are ready for the operations and we also uh, liaising with uh, the uh, the army and the other ground troops for for the operation the message I'll send to the bandits is that we are coming. Earlier, the chief of the air staff visited Governor Nasir al rufai to assure him of the readiness of Nigerian Air Force to rid Kaduna State and the nation in general of banditry and all other forms of criminality. That's why I say they, we are working together. The, the, service, the Air Force and the Army and the Navy, we are all working together and with other security agencies. We are working together to ensure that uh, these bandits are flushed out of the country. We, we are looking at the welfare of the uh, soldiers. Like I told them that uh, if welfare entails both their training, the equipment, and also the em working environment and where they also live. Those are some of the things we, we ensure that is in top gear uh, in the, during my administration. And also, uh, whatever is due to them in terms of allowances and everything will be given to them. Air Marshal Amao also said the welfare of troops will be priority for him. Generally, the security chiefs appeared impressed with the efforts of their personnel in the fight against security threats. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.